I'm out of here. I'm bringing my different coffee cups in. Whatever mood I'm in, I can drink from. Oh, I forgot to take my sound off. How are you doing? This is Kathy representing Strong Arm. Sassy Super Sisters. Hi, Suzette. How are you? Oh, my goodness. Let me turn this sound. I don't know what I did to my phone. I thought I had the sound off. No, I didn't. There we go. Now it's off. How you doing? How's it going? Oh, gosh, I got so much junk going on here. How is everybody doing today? It's raining, or it was. Anyway, today is Friday. I try to do coffee chat. Very informal. The only thing you're going to hear from me is whatever pops in my head. <laughs> I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I want to report. Remember the detox tea? Look at my hair. Oh, my God. I don't have any. Um, hi, Judy. Uh, I want to report on the detox tea. I didn't bring the box in here. But you go back and look at some different videos and you'll see where I did the detox tea and it helped. I didn't have a reaction to it. So it helped me feel better, whatever's in it. So what I'm doing right now with the tea, I'm making sure that I have some made and cold in the refrigerator. And then every time I think about it or want a sip of something, I'll go in there and sip on that detox tea so i didn't have reaction to it which is great because i'm one of them and um so i'm gonna try it up up for a couple of weeks and see what happens and we'll go from there and then i'll let you know if eventually i you know because some of the teas, it takes a couple of times before I realize, yeah, you know, drinking this too much is not a good thing. So we're going to, we're going to wait and see. Um, yeah, we got some rain today. Let me tell you, or we did have, I haven't been outside. How are you doing, Judy? Okay, Alexa, what's the weather in Culpeper, Virginia? Currently. In Culpeper, it's 68 degrees Fahrenheit with mostly cloudy skies. Today, you can expect cloudy skies with a high of 77 degrees and a low of 59 degrees. Yeah, well, it was raining earlier. Oh, I need to know something. Alexa, what's the weather in Culpeper, Virginia for Saturday? Here's the forecast for Saturday, October 7th in Culpeper. Look for clouds with a chance of showers, with a high of 67 degrees Fahrenheit and a low of 41 degrees. I have something I'm supposed to be doing tomorrow. Uh, I gave away a chair. If anybody hasn't followed me on Kathy's Online Sales, go ahead and do that. I gave away a chair. Um, it's called a, oh, have you, I would love to have it because I could cover it because it's a goldish color, but I would love to have it because it's an overstuffed, oversized chair. And you can just kind of prop your feet up on the other arm because I had one a long time ago and I really liked them. Hi, Alice. 70 in Whitney, Texas. Okay. So is everybody doing good? How, how is your weekend going to go? Are y'all going to well, if it ever stops raining, I can accomplish something, right? Um, I just want to let y'all know, um, maybe today, I don't know, sometime or other, 
Um, I'm going to be doing the EVMU, e EVMUX, which is similar to StreamYard. Um, I'm going to try doing that and see if I can't, because they allow you to connect with YouTube for free. And I know I've talked about this before, but I want to really get into it and see if, it, if it's going to work. Uh, so you'll see me popping in, most likely. Um, uh, oh, so I got a gift from Alyssa. She's not on here yet, Alyssa Flores. If she come, if she pops in, she might pop in towards uh, eleven. What well, y'all think about this? Keep it sassy. It's a distressed cap. It is cute as a button. So I'm gonna have it to tease the girls. Because they didn't get one. Only I got one. Um, keeping it sassy, y'all. I can't wear a hat. I don't, I'm not used to wearing hats. <laughs> hey, this will be good for my uh, grandson's game. I got to get used to it, though. I don't know how to wear a hat. Is it that cute? Keep it sassy. 72 degrees downpour through our day in Ohio. Yeah, it's nasty out there today. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, y'all. Wait a minute. Let me look at it. Maybe my head's crooked. <laughs> it could be. You never know. I'll have to ask. I'll have to ask Kelly because I'm going to take it. Hopefully. Oh, that feels better, but I don't know. Why does it look? There we go. That's a little better. I don't, it's this thing, maybe. Something's bugging me. No. Throwing me off. It's that cute, cute, cute. It's distressed. Let me tell you who it's by. It is by K. B E T H O S. I don't know how you pronounce it. K K K Betho B Bethos. I don't know. But they do have a Facebook page, y'all. Uh I can't read it. And a dot com. But it's a it's a vintage type. It's a vintage style. And it has, see how it's, well, I like the big uh, the thread too, but see how it's just uh, distressed. See that? Is that cute? I just think it's cute. I like it. Cute, cute, cute. So thank you, Alyssa. If you pop in later on, I'll grab the hat and put it on for you. It's cute. It's cute. I love it. So I'll embarrass my grandson and take it to a ball game. He gets embarrassed real easy. Um, but I think it's cute. I love it. And um, it also, and it's got this, uh, oh, look at the heart on the back. It's got this Velcro. So you, it's easy to adjust once you get it, once you get it on. Oh, here it is. Uh, K. Bethos, however you pronounce it, Vintage. So it's a cotton hat. I just, I just like it. I just think it's, it's the cutest. Got the little hearts on the back. But anyway, so this gives me an idea to do a cap on our, um, hi Melton. Um, this gives me an idea to, um, make a cap for, um, Wherever we're at, Printify, or, yeah, Printify, I think. I don't know if they got caps over there or not. But one of the places that we can print, have a print on demand. Um, yeah, I like this. It says keep it sassy. So we can, um, we can do something similar and have it um, printed on a cap. 
It won't be, of course, unless they have a vintage style cap. But I loved it. I really do. So what's everybody up to? Hope the weather's going to treat y'all right for the weekend. I'm not. Anyway, let me tell you what I got into uh, before this came live. Let me tell you. I was that now give me your opinion, y'all. They were uh it was of course probably a repeat of a video that's happened to somebody. I don't know, but anyway, I watch all these audits to make sure that everybody's doing what they're supposed to do because that's the kind of person I am. Anyway, so um give me your opinion. I don't know how they happen to this lady request from a police department their belongings i don't know if the car was in an accident i don't know if they if, if the cops had to impound it i don't know i didn't get that far into it so tell me what you think about this so the lady is going to claim her um, items from this police department. And so she is saying, okay, I got that. Okay. Okay. But now I need the credit card. There's a credit card, not in this list. And she says, they say, no, we can't give you the credit card. And she goes, you gave me all the other credit cards. Why won't you give me this credit card? And so they didn't want her to be, they didn't want her to film it. They didn't want, they wanted all recordings off. And she goes, no, I'm not doing that. I want my property. They said, we can't give it to you because the credit card is in your husband's name. And she said, that doesn't make sense. And they said, we can't give it to you. And then it went round and round and round. She wanted to speak to a supervisor after going round and round and round. And then finally, they had an envelope with the list of the property on it, which was supposed to be the credit card. And she said, um, open it before I sign for it. Because they said... Here it is, signed for it. She goes, open it before I sign for it. And they would not do it. And that was the end of the video. I got to find the rest of the video to find out what in the heck was going on. So what would you do? Would you sign for a property that they said was there and then come to find out it wasn't? Because I think that's where it's headed. Um, hi, Darlene. She was signed. You missed the hat. Alyssa sent me a hat. Keep it sassy hat. I told her I was going to show it off today. Anyway, so um, what would you do? I mean, you know. Would you tell, tell them to show it to you first? I think I would. I think I would. And then they told her she had a problem. Because she wasn't trusting them. And she said, you know what? Yeah, it is cute, isn't it? I love it. Um, she said, um, uh, you're causing me not to trust. So I got to find the end of the video because I can't, you know how it comes in spurts, part one, part two, and all that. I got to find out what actually happened because it's driving me nuts. Um they didn't want her to film, which they have a right to. And she didn't want to sign for something that she wasn't seeing. She said, I I'm giving you permission. Open the envelope and show me the card. And they wouldn't do it. She had to sign for it first. And I'm thinking, this is not cool. Not cool. So today... I don't know what happened to me last week, but I was like yucky. And that's why I got the detox tea. It seemed to help. 
Dawn Rain. Have you ever had it? Let me see. Look, talk to the chair and I'll go run and get the uh, box. I need to put a sign on my chair. Um, it's this, if y'all remember. Oh, come on, focus. There it is. And um, it has green tea, which I, I drink green tea, but it's got organic dandelion, milk thistle, and natural lemon flavor. Well, I haven't had the milk thistle or the dandelion yet. So I'm kind of thinking that this might be what I need on those yucky days. Yeah, back in two seconds. Um, yeah, I got to put a sign. I got to put a sign. I always tell y'all to talk to the chair because I'm embarrassed. And I don't, I, I don't like having to get up. But sometimes I do. I'll forget something. And I wasn't planning on talking about the tea. But I thought, okay, well, now's my opportunity to let y'all know that the tea is um, doing, um, I guess I was planning on talking about the tea, but I didn't have it in my head to get the, the box to remind y'all. Um, and the cookies, everybody was forgetting the cookies at the family thing, so I gave them to a bunch of kids. And I'll have to ask her if um, the kids liked it because they got a pretty good sized family. Oh, I could do that. I could do that actually. Okay, so let me fill y'all in too. We got a new backdrop rod that is a tension rod that goes on forever. Because we're so scared somebody's going to trip over the way we have our backdrop on our videos and stuff. And we're also considering getting some different colors. But this a rod goes forever. So we have a 10-foot space that we want the, the rod to fit. I haven't actually put the rod up there. But I did um, size it up and it's going to work. And it's got adjustments to it. <clears throat> Here's hoping it works anyway. If it doesn't work, I have a plan B. So uh, it'll be okay. So yeah, so we're going to try to switch up. Somebody gave us a green screen one time. And I don't know what I did with it. I can't find it because we haven't used it in a couple years. Quite a few years, actually. Um, so, uh, and we, we don't, yeah. So that's our interview and our video day is going to be, what did I tell y'all, the 19th? Is that right? Hold on. Let me try. Let me see. Yeah, the 19th. So we're going to have an interview. And... Uh, it, 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 it's actually a podcast recording. So she records. I'll let y'all know when it comes out. She's a reseller. And she she said, oh, I'm sorry. I thought y'all were resellers. And I said, well, I am. Kelly is. And Rhonda sells to Tara. Oh, good. Okay. So she's going to interview us. She's all up in there in the reselling eBay type. Do you know what I mean? Um, now, where's my... I'm playing with this and it's not working out very well. Okay. And uh, so, yeah. Let's see what's going on with family. Mom's getting, Mama Sassy's getting all um, in planning mode <laughs> for going to the beach. She's going to the beach. And while she's at the beach, I'll be working. Um because it gives me extra time when she's on a trip to get things, some things done. And um, 
She wants me to go to the beach with her, and one day maybe I will, but not right now. Oh, and I started my Friday. I should not do this. <laughs> this is a public service announcement. Don't pay bills on a Friday because that ruins your whole weekend. Pay your bills at the beginning of the week, and you can go with the flow for the week and then be okay on the weekend. Don't pay bills on a Friday. <laughs> that messed me all up this morning. So, yeah. So, I have... Yeah. So, uh, you guys can always uh, message us if you have um, any type of suggestion or things that you would like to see. Kelly's on a roll with the blog and the recipes and stuff. She's on a roll with that. So I am tickled with that. And um, <clears throat> we try to contribute. But, you know, it's hard for me to only have a couple of hours. Yeah, Suzette, don't pay bills on a Friday. Don't even look at your mail on a Friday. <laughs> Don't open the bill if you know it is in your email. Don't do it on a Friday. <laughs> and I'm cursing myself the whole time I'm doing it because I want to get it done. And I'm going, don't do this. Don't do this. But you got to do this. Don't do this. But that's okay. This too shall pass. Um, how's your weather, Darlene? Because it's starting to, you know, do its thing here. Um, I am, um, uh, let's see, I am, usually in the wintertime, I have either an extra coat or an extra hoodie or something like that in my car. I just carry it in my car. And that way I have it for an emergency. Um, you guys, I don't know what y'all do, but since I have to usually... I have to go somewhere every day. So in the winter, I always have extra. I always have gloves. I always have extra whatever. The colors. Oh, my God. Uh, <clears throat> As you can see, I like fall colors. <laughs> um, yeah, the colors are getting. I should probably take a couple pictures. I know my son always goes... Uh, well, he used to. I don't know if he d will is now or if he's already done it. But if he has, I'll try to get some pictures from him of the colors of um, Is there no way for you to post it here? Uh, Darlene. Hi, Flo. Flo, look what Alyssa gave me. Alyssa Flores that's usually on here. I'm bragging. It says, keep it sassy. And is this cute or what? Is there no way for you to post it? You can always send it a uh, message. See if you can message uh, uh, Sassy Silver Sisters or me or whatever. And um, I'll post it. Do they not let you post on here? Wait a minute. Let me look. I guess not. Uh, let me see. Hang on. Uh, fall colors. I'm gonna I'm gonna try something and see what happens. See if I can. Okay, there's fall colors. Let me see if I can save the picture. <sighs> save image. Let me see if I can do it. If I can, uh, it might not even let me do it. You know what I mean? Isn't that cute? No photo option. Okay, let me see something. I don't see. Why isn't there a photo option? Wait a minute. Let me see what this says. No. Send me the photo and I can share it with how I do the um, stuff.
stuff I talk about. Do you know what I mean? Like, fall background, like this. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Oh, I, I, I need to look into that, darling. Where it says fall background. See how it lets me. See how it lets me share? Okay. And then where is this place that you're talking about? Um, what area? So they'll know. Let me go to Messenger. Okay. Let me know when you sent it. And then I could post it. I could share it here. There's got to be a way. Why doesn't they, uh, they allow you? Maybe because people get weird. Yeah, maybe because people get weird on here. I'm not really quite sure. Okay, so anyway, enough of that, of, of you watching me think. Don't forget, everyone, to, let's see, where are we? Extra, extra, share the screen. Let me make sure I'm on the right thing. Don't forget to subscribe. And we're trying to share it with everybody, which I haven't seen some of this stuff. I've got five bites. Wait a minute, let me make sure I'm sharing it. Yeah, I've got five bites. That's a bit. Okay, wait a minute. Where is it? It's not letting me do what I want it to do. Pumpkin pie bites. Is that cute or what? Oh, the little, the little pumpkin uh, bakery stuff. Cute. and pumpkins. Let me just make sure you're looking at it. Yeah, you are. Because uh, um, YouTube also has little shorts, too. You know, where you just use little short videos when you don't have a long one. This is Don't Play. I like this one. I like this one where the uh, older sister said, oh, you know, that's how I was when I was little. I got in trouble all the time. I picked up Rhonda. Me and Rhonda were usually together when we were little. And if somebody did something, they wanted to go to. And my sister, I was, I got in trouble a lot for that. A lot. Hurry, or and we've got Sister Squad, and we've got me. Okay, everybody, this is the update. The squirrel situation with um, y'all. The squirrel situation. Uh, there she is. Okay, hang on. I'm going to try to, to 
where are we at in this video? Okay. I am going to try to, um, okay. I'm, she shared them. So hang on. These, these are beautiful. Picture perfect. Okay. Let's see if I can do this. See if it'll let me. Let me see. Ah, it's gonna let me. Ah, it's gonna let me share pictures. Okay. Beautiful, Darlene. Let me see if it's working. Okay. North of Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Thank you for sharing. I'm going to show these to Mama Sassy uh, because look at, look at picture perfect. I can't handle this. Look at that. I bet that water is, you know what, and cold too. Beautiful. Thank you so much for sharing. Isn't that pretty? I love it. I love it. that's the this is the, the prettiest one. That is the prettiest one of all, I think, because of the brightness of the colors and reflection in the water. Thank you, darling. Thank you so much. Okay, let me get off here. That was nice of you to share. So now we figured it out. Um, but I'm also going to look into it. I am going to show her because she'll get a kick out of it. Because uh, she loves to travel anyway. But her family is also from Canada. Her back in the day. Um, let's see. How did that work? Grandma Helen, which is her mom was born in Canada, and they came to the U.S. for her dad to work. I think that's how it went. I'll have, I will, we'll get her back on to tell some stories again. Um, yeah, she'll love it. She'll love it. Now, did you take these pictures, or were they um, taken someplace else? Um, or did somebody else take them? That's what I'm trying to say. So I can, I can explain to her when I show them to her. But she will love them because that's, that's, that one picture with the reflection is, I love it. Okay, my ladies. We got peace cards. Alyssa Flores, thank you very much for the gift. And I know she's not on here yet, but she will see it later. She will catch it up. Thank you. Oh, good. Friends on Facebook. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha. I'll let her know that you wanted her to see them. She'll get a kick out of it. You have a great weekend, too, Miss Darlene. Okay, we got peace cards. Anybody that doesn't know, it's inner peace cards, Dr. Wayne W. Dyer. Um, I've had this pack of cards forever, and I wanted to keep them, but I had to have a reason to keep them. So I said, why don't I share them on Facebook? You have a great weekend, Darlene. Anyway, so what I do is shuffle them up. And then I read one and, okay, darling. And um, if it is duplicated, like if I've read it before, that must mean we, we need it. That's all I could say. I wonder if it's got anything about paying bills in here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, but I love them. I, I like the whole thing. I like, um, you can look them up. He's no longer with us, but he, there are a couple videos on YouTube. Okay, I've got one out of the... Oh, I like this one. This is about me. I live my life in my own way. 
Thank you. I like the colors in these cards. And it says, you can't go around being what everyone wants you to be. Living your life through other people's rules and expect to be happy and have inner peace. So let me read that again because I read it wrong. It says, you can't go around being what everyone wants you to be, living your life through other people's rules and expect to be happy and have inner peace. And that is true. I, me and my daughter talk about, there it is, talk about that kind of stuff all the time. And, <clears throat> you know, I'm one of them people um, that everybody's saying shh <laughs> to. I either say the wrong thing, do the wrong thing. Um, I'm always spilling stuff and I don't care anymore. <laughs> exactly, Suzette. It's like, be true to yourself because, yeah, right? See? So just be yourself, you know? I don't, I don't, if I, if I, <clears throat> if I was the person that was not, Okay, let me explain. I've always dressed differently. I've always done things differently. And there's a saying, just because I do it different doesn't make it wrong. So doing things differently doesn't make you wrong. Dressing differently does not make you wrong. Doing things in your own way that nobody understands why you're doing it that way does not make you wrong. They would just do it differently. And, and I've heard this all my life. All my life I've heard this. Kathy, why are you wearing that? Because I want to. Uh, Kathy, why are you doing that? Because I need to. Kathy, why are you doing it this way? Because that's the way I have to do it. <laughs> I don't know. All my life. All, all my life. Be, just because you do things differently does not mean you're wrong. So, you know, you have to do, you have to do what's best for you, not the other person. You have to dress, dress according to you. Don't dress for somebody else. It, it doesn't work because then you're not comfortable. It's like everybody, you know, everybody thinks they have an opinion, but I just don't take their opinion personal. Never have. I'm sorry. You don't understand why I do what I do. Uh, I, it's, I'm just me. I'm glad I don't worry about what other people think. <laughs> I will apologize though <laughs> if I if if I do something to hurt somebody's feeling. I will apologize, you know. But I won't apologize for being being me. And the kids, the kids know me, you know. My kids, the, the grandkids are now going through the embarrassment stage. <laughs> Don't be embarrassed about me because I ain't changing for you. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah. So, that's just the way it is. You have to be yourself. I cannot handle the stress of trying to please everybody else. I can't handle it. Never have been. Never will. Kathy, you wear T-shirts all the time. Yeah, because I like wearing T-shirts all the time. Kathy, you wear jeans all the time. Yeah, that's because I like wearing jeans all the time. I don't dress or do anything for other people. Now, if it's like my daughter's wedding, my granddaughter's wedding, and, and I tried with another granddaughter, that didn't work out because of communication, but I try to please that way. Like if you're in a wedding or if you're going to, you know, I always ask the dress code and find out what I'm supposed to wear and stuff like that. That's their day. And I try to accommodate as much as I can. Um, but other than that, I'm just, I just do my own thing. And they find out people really and truly do find out later on in life 
because I go, now you see, now you see why I did this because of this. Because if I had done it differently, it would have ended up differently and not good for the situation. But ask me if I care. No, I don't. I don't want to hurt people's feelings. If I hurt people's feelings over something that I did or said wrong, it bothers me. I don't intentionally go to hurt somebody's feelings. So if if what I say or do ends up being a problem, I will try to catch up with them. You know what I mean? I'll try to apologize. I, this is not what I meant, you know, or whatever. All right, my ladies, let's keep it sassy. And we'll figure out if we can get some caps in our shop to keep it sassy. Um, I love it, Alyssa. Okay, ladies, I'm going to have to play some music and get out of here. I like this hat. I like this hat. It makes me giggle. All right, let's see. Uh, have a great weekend, everybody. Let me find the music. Where did the music go? And I'll get out of here. And I'll see you Monday. Where did my music go? It's here somewhere. There it is.